みんなどうもこんばんはSenselessly slaughtered as his people watched on in horror. In the end, he will sign the contract to end all contracts. In the secluded land of the immortal shogun, the Bakufu rules eternal. But what do mortals see of the eternity chased after by their god? The god of wisdom's enemy is wisdom itself, and the oasis of knowledge is a mirage in the desert of ignorance. In the city of scholars, there is a push for folly, yet the god of wisdom makes no argument against it. The god of justice lives for the spectacle of the courtroom, seeking to judge all other gods. But even she knows not to make an enemy of the divine. The rules of war are woven in the womb. The victors shall burn bright, while the losers must turn to ash. When the god of war shares this secret with the traveler, it is because she has her reasons. She is a god with no love left for her people, nor do they have any left for her. Her followers hope only to be on her side when the day of her rebellion against the divine comes at last. In the perpetual meantime of a sheltered eternity, most are content to live and not to dream. But in the hidden corners where the god's gaze does not fall, There are those who dream of dreaming. Some say a few are chosen and the rest are dregs. But I say we humans have our humanity. We will defy this world with a power from beyond. Now, you who has set foot in this world, your journey has reached its end, but one final doorway remains. Step forth if you have understood the meaning of your journey. Defeat me, command me to step aside. Show me that you are worthier than I to rescue her. Then, the threads of all fate will be yours to reweave. My memory has all but faded completely. But I will always remember how much she too loved these flowers. <laughs> 